All right, guys, I got some AC Smart Seal. I got a cartridge here, it's a quick shot. It came in this pack with the reusable Easy Inject. Now it's got Cool Enhancer, which is visible under any UV light. So this stuff here is great for evaporators um, that may have formicary corrosion or micro leaks or pinhole leaks that you can't exactly fix with a torch or track down with soap bubbles. So there is a fear, now this is an oil-based product, there's a fear that when this stuff comes into contact with air or moisture that it hardens up inside of the system. So my experiment, I'm just going to take this, this bottle, okay, I've got the water in it that was in it already, this is not uh, tap water, this is water that was in the bottle. Okay, I've taken the, the label off as well. I'm going to inject the cartridge into the bottle, I'm going to swish it around a bit and I'm going to leave it in my truck overnight and we're gonna check it in the morning or later on in the day and see what kind of state it's in. Now I put this in a system um, about 10 months ago that had a leak every six or seven months. Okay, there's a stack of refrigerant tags and the leak has not come back. Okay, it was about six to seven months it leaked. It's been about 10 months and there's no sign of any loss of refrigerant. So, like I said, the fear is that this stuff will get into your tools and your gauges, I use my Testo gauges by the way on this system and I'm still using them today. Um, the fear is it's gonna harden up and clog up TX valves and gum up the compressor valves, so on and so forth. So I'm gonna put this into this bottle of water and see what happens after 24 hours. All right, I got the cap off. Smart seal, okay, there's my bottle of water. Put it in there. Okay, I'm gonna put the cap back on, shake it up, leave it overnight. So I've got in the bottle here, I've been shaking it up a bit, and it looks like oil and water, to be honest with you. Um, there's little bubbles, and you can see the oil separating from the water like oil does, oil and water don't mix. And there's just a little bit of foaming going on. But we've got a lot of water in there. But my whole point is to make sure that nothing is gonna harden up. All right, so this is about four days later. I was gonna do it 24 hours, but I haven't had time to come back to this because this uh, digital scroll has been giving me a lot of grief, but we got it back up and running finally. So I'm back to my bottle of AC Smart Seal and water. Now, as you can see, there's nothing hard inside. We just have the oil and water separating like that when we shake it up, which is completely normal with oil and water. On the side of the, the bottle, we got no hard deposits. And if I take my finger, and I run it on the inside. All I have is some some oil residue. So I think we can conclude that AC Smart Seal, quick shot, oil-based product does not harden up when it meets water or air. Happy HVACing guys.